Good morning lovely souls, it's Tim Wilde, happy Monday. It's the start of another beautiful week on planet Earth and I um, hope you're all raring to go <laughs> with all the energies that are coming in. And um, I've just, I've been kind of toying with a few ideas this morning about, because um, I know a lot of us are feeling quite fatigued with, with, with kind of holding, holding space, holding light at the moment. What I think the majority of you out there at the moment will find that you're doing if, if you're either you're either kind of shouting the truth from the rooftops or very solidly holding this new higher space that we have created. And um, obviously we've got kind of the most magnificent backup from, from the angels, the archangels, the dragons, the unicorns, everybody who's helping now has has converged on planet earth in order for us to to you know move move energetically into this 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 gold print this higher space that we've created i've um i'm not going to use the word blueprint anymore paul de brio carey corrected me and said it's actually a gold print the 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 energy that we're moving into what we what we've written and what we're what we're creating is called a gold print i think that's a beautiful word so what i'd like to share this morning is what's come through and it's Archangel Metatron describes it as dimensional field stabilization. I know that might sound all kind of terribly technical but what in actual fact it is it's a simple technique to hold you stable in what otherwise can be kind of like feel a bit like stormy currents now because we've got all of this retrograde energy going on. Um, a a friend, an old friend of mine who also is, is has been studying astrology said that the kind of between now and and December is is as I've said to you before it's the most incredible cooking pot of energies so for those of us holding the light it's important that we take that little bit of extra time to hold our fields high and stable because it's very easy to kind of get pulled sideways get pulled down knocked out knocked out of kilter so wherever you are in the world this is just close your eyes and begin to focus on yourself take a few deep breaths if you have a crystal grab one now if not then then just just kind of maybe come back and get one later on so just taking a few deep breaths breathe in through your nose out through your mouth and completely allow yourself to relax Focus on two very important chakras. You're focusing on your heart centre for your breathing. So breathe into your heart centre and see it lighting up a beautiful white golden colour. And immediately you set your intention to your heart centre. The heart centre will expand from shoulder to shoulder. And also breathe into your earth star chakra below the soles of your feet. So bring your intention and your focus and your breath to your earth star below the soles of your feet. And immediately you do that, you'll start to feel the soles of your feet buzzing. The earth star chakra is very active, it's very, it's very responsive. So just set your intention, breathe into the earth star chakra. So breathing into the heart, breathing into the earth star now, see your earth star chakra beginning to light up a very bright silver below the soles of your feet. And as you're breathing into this, as you're focusing on the earth star, you'll start to see it becoming infused with gold. And that gold is coming from the ley lines the fifth dimensional matrix that our planet is actually highly consistent of at this moment. So see your Earth star drawing in golden fragments or almost lines or you might even see it as liquid light now flowing into your Earth star chakra and see the two merging together. Silver and gold and beautiful diamond light just flowing into your Earth star. Attune yourself to the higher energies of our planet, the fifth dimensional frequencies that exist here. Allow yourself to bond with them. Know that you are a part of Earth and that she is a part of you. Energize. 
Allow yourselves to bond together. Allow this flood of supportive energy to move into your earth star chakra and light it up. And now you will start to feel this golden and silver. You might see other colours, all of this energy starting to flow up your legs now. Okay, so feel it moving up your shins, through your knees, into your thighs. And feel it lighting up your base chakra, which is a beautiful platinum colour. Feel it lighting up and anchoring into your base. Then flowing <coughs> into your sacral. Then into your navel chakra. Then into your solar plexus. And feel it lighting up your heart. So all of this lovely, beautiful, golden, fifth dimensional energy that is coming from our planet, the fifth dimensional aspect of our planet is now lighting up within your heart center Allow it to pause there for a few moments. And move it into your throat, your third eye, your crown, your causal, your soul star, and then your stellar gateway chakra, about a meter above the top of your head. And as soon as it touches your stellar gateway chakra, allow it to light it up like a beautiful golden orange beacon. And then allow the energy to move back down again, down through your soul star, your causal, your crown, your third eye, your throat, your heart, your solar plexus, your navel, your sacral, your base, and then back to your earth star chakra below the soles of your feet. Now keep repeating this until you feel balanced. Move the energy up from your earth star until it touches your stellar gateway, and then move it back down again. So this becomes a wave moving up and down through your body. And as this energy is moving up from the earth, touching your stellar gateway, moving back down again, feel yourself stabilizing in this frequency. Allow it to just completely balance you physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually, and just remove any inconsistencies, any imbalances, anything that might be just knocking you out of kilter, giving you the wobbles at the moment. This is the most grounding and the most stabilizing thing that you can do. So feel that wave of light moving up. Feel it moving back down again once it touches your stellar gateway chakra, back down to the Earth star. And then after you've done this, you can do this for as long as you want, or you can just do it a few times. State the word unify. And all of a sudden, you will sense and feel yourself becoming a column of solid golden, silver, rainbow, diamond light, whatever is most prominent for you at this time. Just take a few moments to sit within this. This is you, this is your light form, okay? This is you stabilized beyond multiple dimensional realities in your highest vibration that is absolutely completely suitable for you at this moment in time. And just continue to breathe and relax. You might want to start breathing this energy outwards into your spiritual fields. Remember, your spiritual fields aren't limited in any way, shape or form. 
They can expand for as far as you want them to, or you can just keep them around you for a limit for a limited space just remember that your vibration has the capacity to touch and light up others as well even though you're not intending to under spiritual law we are not allowed to you know interfere with people without their permission but you can set a spiritual field okay and all of that in, and the intention of setting that spiritual field is simply to light up everything around you under grace from the heart so just set that frequency And just allow that, if you're still rolling the waves up and down from the Earth Star to the, the Stellar Gateway and back down again, just keep doing it. Or just reside in your column of very beautiful bright light. Oh, Mr. Crow. <laughs> and when you're ready, open your eyes. Okay, now... This is a technique that you can do when you are walking down the road, when you're, you're going about your daily business, when you're driving your car. I never recommend, obviously don't close your eyes when you're driving your car, but you can easily visualize or ask for the energies to be moving up from your Earth Star Chakra to touch the stellar gateway and move back down again. This provides a balance, a stabilization, and that is, what we need to be doing um, on a on a on an energy level at the moment because it's as, as I, you've heard me say before it's very easy to kind of get buffeted around with the kind of the the multiple quantities of energy that are are kind of almost like pulling on us you know the needs of others the needs of the collective the needs of um of of the 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 drive of the shift you know the the, the shift of, the shift from 3d to 5d has really gone into high gear but it's the transitional it's the messy period so you keep yourself as stable as possible and everything else around you will align to that frequency okay so i hope you find that useful and sending you all loads of love and uh wishing you all a beautiful start to the week talk to you soon bye for now